Hello, and welcome to Rentometer's Learning Short, Getting Started with Rentometer Pro. This demo will give you a quick overview of how to log in and run your first rent comparison search using Rentometer Pro. Let's get started. First, go to our website at www.rentometer.com. If you're a registered user, simply log in. If you don't have a login yet, you'll need to take a couple seconds to register for our Pro Free Trial. This free trial gives you 10 free pro reports to try out at your leisure. No further commitments required. As you use the free reports, the system will let you know how many you have left. And once your free reports run out, the system will revert to our standard report format. You can decide whether you'd like to continue using the pro version by purchasing a pro subscription. And you can get all the information about the pro features and the price plans by clicking at the pricing link at the top of our page. Okay. So once you're signed into your account, you can start running your rent comparisons. Just a quick note, you'll know if you're using our Pro version because it will say Rentometer Pro right here on this logo. So for this quick start tutorial, we're going to run an address search and you'll see that the system defaults to the address search tab right here. Begin by entering the address that you'd like to get the rent comparison for. Be sure to enter the complete address including directional details like west and east and specific roadway terms like road, street, or boulevard. Sometimes you'll notice that our system will serve up an autocomplete address option when it recognizes the address that you're entering. When available, always click on the autocomplete address that the system offers to ensure the best search result. Next up, if you know the rent for the address, you can enter it here. If you don't know the rent, leave it blank. Next. Enter the number of bedrooms that you want to compare rents for. I'm going to set my search for rentals with two bedrooms. Enter in how far back you'd like to review the rental data. Do you want to look back just a few months? Or maybe you'd like to review the past year or two. Next, you can enter how large of a radius around the address you'd like to review. Or if you leave it at auto, our system will determine the radius based on the amount of rental data we have in the area. Choose the building type that you'd like to compare. Sometimes when I run reports, I like to set this field to the any option so I can first get a feel for the rentals in the area and then I go back and narrow the filter down to the specific type like apartment or condo. For the report branding, pro subscribers have the option of either leaving our logo at the top of the report so it says rentometer or they can set up their branding with us so it's available in the drop down. That way they can generate and print rent reports with their logo and contact information displayed right at the top. Lastly, simply click the Analyze Address button to get your rent report in a matter of seconds. To learn more about the results of your search, make sure to check out our Rentometer Learning Short, How to Read a Rentometer Pro Report, which reviews the rent comparison report in detail. Thanks for joining us today. This has been a production of Rentometer.com. We really do love all things rental data. You can learn more about us at www.rentometer.com.